Hey, what's up, everybody? All right, so we got, uh, I'm going to put this over here. <clears throat> we got our stuff from uh, Amazon, so we got to, still waiting on, I think, another couple packages. Um, if I'm quick, I can open these up, figure out what I need. Might have some time to order. Uh, we got three packages here. Um, so, let's see. I'm not sure. I just have like a special chair thing. Yeah, okay, let's get right to it. Um, I think these are going to be uh, my frames. Tattoo frame, iron, new, uh, it's only XG something number on it. Okay. Alright. So, what do they do to attach these? So, yeah, it's got some good weight to it. Okay. So, let's get this one out. It's definitely not perfect, I can tell you that right now. It's kicked up in the top here. Um, but, we'll see. It was $9. But the real proof is when you try to put it together. So, what I've done is I've ordered some cheap machines take the parts off of because honestly like they want like 12 or 13 dollars for coils this one's packaged a little bit differently um, so somehow I think this might be a little bit better of one It actually looks really good. Yeah, this one, this one's good. <clears throat> so the other one's crooked. I mean. It's like crooked all the way around, I think, if I put it flat on the table. Okay, so we got these two. So... This should just be a, a barrel. I can't believe how much they want for these damn things. I mean, they've always been expensive, but... Like, literally, nowadays I can buy a machine for the price of a damn grip tube. Pretty heavy. Decent so far.
guys. Uh, it feels really cheesy. It's pretty nice. Okay, we'll put that over here. Alright, these two here were the ones that I'm, I ordered for parts. So this is from this company, Automus or whatever. So they're like $19 plus in tax. And they're uh, alloy frames. Another thing too we need to do is I need to go get my magnet. Let's make sure that these aren't magnetic. So, this, this is not magnetic, very little, this thing barely wants to stick on it, that's not a good thing. This is stainless, it actually uh, is slightly magnetic. This is totally magnetic. Can you guys see? Okay, watch. So, um, you would probably need to use a yoke with this. It's just not that magnetic. I wonder if they, um, no. Okay, anyway, I want a magnetic frame. I don't want something like that. Let's see what's in here. Now, and these might be okay in their own. I don't know. So they can not want to come out. So. <laughs> It looks like the same thing um, that I just got over there that's not magnetic. Pretty close. Let's try something here. Anyway, um, you're basically paying 10 bucks for this. Get all the parts on it, and you can take all the parts off. Put it on that. I don't think I'm going to use this. Um, I'm going to see if it's here's another one. Oh, this is different. Um, uh, this isn't the, I don't think this is the one I ordered. Maybe. Okay, so. I think this one is slightly magnetic. That's just because the yoke is down there. Alright, so anyway. That's what we got in the mail today. And um, I had to sit down and figure out um, what to do with this non-magnetic 
crooked frame. I think what I'll do is I'll just contact Amazon and just order a replacement and uh, see what I get. Thanks for watching.